Hi guys, Todd here again with TW Home Show. I wanted to share with you today uh, a storage deck box that I got. I'm going to be putting that together today. We'll see how easy those are to put together. Hopefully they're easy. Um, you can use them around your pool area. I'm going to use them for actually our chair cushions. You can store those in a deck box, the cushions and pillows. And guys, here it is. It looks a little bit intimidating because of the size of the box, but uh, that's it guys. I guess bigger the better. So we'll go ahead. I'm going to drag this around to the back patio because we have a patio uh, that we're going to put it on out back. That's where our chair cushions are that I want to store in this thing. And so guys, if you want to see how this thing goes together, stay tuned. This is not very heavy, uh, it's just bulky. So I'm gonna drag it around back here and we'll get started. All right, let's get started. Now usually uh, these don't require any tools or very minimal tools from what I'm used to. They're kind of like a Rubbermaid system here. I got another one, I'll show you. I got this other one two years ago. We use over here. Hi duckies. Hi, duck duck. This is the one we got a couple years ago. It's pretty handy. We keep uh, like uh, our wood sticks and stuff in there, uh, charcoal, lighting fluid, and stuff like that. Uh, light vests for our pedal boat. So, yeah, that was a good buy. I like that one. This one's going to sit a little bit uh, down, it's not going to sit as high. So let's unpack this, see what we've got inside the box here. That looks like it might be the top. It says inside. Looks like the side panel or end panel, the other end panel. back or front and another back or front piece these bars here I believe guys are just for uh, shipping we'll see oh it even comes with a uh, strut for pneumatic opening of the door that's cool I didn't know it was gonna come with that two of them one for each side this piece here, a couple little pieces here, and we do have some screws. So we will be attaching this together with screws. And our instruction manual here. Looks like they clip right in place first. Okay, these bars are used as reinforcement bars, so we will be using these bars. Get all this out of here and we'll get the box out of the way. Number one, get these two panels out with the steel bars. Pretty simple. Slide that down. It says to be careful of these sharp ends here. Has a picture of a pair of gloves, which I don't 
have with me. Okay. Well, of course, I put them in the wrong way. Just put it in this way. Just two sides. Jump. Now, it says clip it in to one of these end pieces here. R07. There's one R07. This is R07. This one's labeled on the inside. R07, it says. And it is showing it. Six R O six, it's this one showing it like this. Clips right in there. This actually shows a picture in the directions with two people holding this to attach it. But this is how I always put my projects together, pretty much by myself. This is not the right way. It was supposed to go on the other way. I was kind of thinking so. It all goes like this, I believe. Like this. 
and then these kind of match up. You could put a lock in here if you wanted to lock this thing for some reason. It's only plastic, so I wouldn't lock any valuables in it, like jewelry or gold. But keep kids out of it. If you're storing like uh, grilling utensils or starter fluid, stuff like that, might want to keep it locked. Guys, this is very, very big. Okay, it's like a big bathtub. So I'm gonna throw some cushions in there. See what it looks like, how much it will store. So you could store the cushions standing up like that. Works great, guys. I like it. So if you learned something new today, maybe you discovered that you need a pool or deck box like this, give me a thumbs up below the video. I'll leave the links in the description about these boxes, both of them, that I've got for my back patio. I'll leave those links in the description below, and you'll find the links there as well. Thank you guys, and I'll see you on the next video. Get all that dog fur off. All right, guys, I put it right behind our two lounge chairs here. Easily stores our pillows in there. Still have a way to walk past here. And that's a wrap. On a nice, steamy Saturday afternoon. This is not